welcome back to another video if you're new my name is Chanda from natural curls and today I will be talking to you about something a little bit different from what I normally talk about um, but I think it will be something that will help all of us um, I will be talking about eating healthy and I will share with you a meal that um, a breakfast meal that I prepared within about 20 to 30 minutes and I think it's something some of you would want to try out I think it's nutritious and healthy and even as we tr strive to grow healthy natural hair I think it's important that we also understand that what we eat will automatically affect how uh, our hair looks um, before that I want to just it's a new month and I'm so happy um, that we've entered a new month because then it's an opportunity for us to learn something new and probably share a few ideas here and there so the before I share the meal I just want to talk about some products that I'm using as you can see I have some cornrows uh, and some twists at the back so these are the products that I'm using because some of you I think have been asking me what I'm using so this is what I'm using um, it's dark and lovely it's written ultra light oil moisturizer normally if you're getting a spray a moisturizing spray the first thing you should look for is that the ingredients at the back should be written should have the first ingredient as aqua or water the other one that I'm using is this one olive oil black castor or it's actually written detangles notes conditions and moisturizers for braids protective and natural hairstyle so you may want to try this i love how it smells so sometimes i use this and then other times i use it just depends sometimes i just want to change things a bit and then i also still using my favorite it's slowly finishing but i do have another bottle so i'm still happy that i still have enough for the next two months or three months yeah so um i will be talking about uh, i will be sharing with you like i said about eating healthy and this is a breakfast meal that i prepared it's an omelet and also um if you yeah, struggle eating beetroot this is a good way to prepare it because you won't even know that you're eating beetroot and then obviously there will also be boiled potatoes which i'll show you how to also prepare so please um enjoy the video and we'll see you soon bye bye so you will need to grate um, one medium-sized beetroot one two medium-sized carrots and one medium-sized apple and uh, the three are the ingredients that you're going to use so that's the grated apple and then you're going to mix the three including um, some juice from the orange that i just cut so you're going to squeeze the juice onto the three the carrot the beetroot and the apple um, the orange works very well because it takes away that strong scent of the beetroot So you won't even know when you're eating the salad that you're actually eating a beetroot salad So you mix the three you mix them thoroughly and then um, you have to put them in a bowl and Put them in the fridge put the salad in the fridge as you work on your potatoes and your omelet so you get some medium-sized potatoes maybe about it depends on how many people are going to actually join you so i was preparing for two people so i used about seven uh, medium-sized potatoes you cut them in such a way that you allow the potatoes to absorb um, the the spices that you're going to use and also the salt so you put them in a saucepan you don't have to peel them all you have to make sure is that the, the potatoes are thoroughly washed. So you add 500 ml of water and some salt and pepper, a bit, maybe about a tablespoon of cooking oil or extra virgin olive oil, and then potato spice and any other spice that you think you'd love to add to the potatoes, but you don't want to over spice them. So you cover that and you cook for about 15 to 20 minutes then you get four eggs and uh, two bell peppers red you can actually add green as well red and yellow is what i used um a small onion and um half of a median potato so you cut those up and you mix together with the eggs 
so I used um, I cut up the red pepper and the yellow pepper and I added those these are very good for hair growth um, they are rich in vitamins so you want to include them in your diet yeah so after that you just add the the ingredients that you've cut you've chopped up um, that's the tomato onion red pepper yellow pepper and green pepper if you want so as the omelette will be cooking i'll also cut up some as the omelette and the potatoes are cooking i also cut my watermelon i'm sure you can see it my son loves to observe what i'm cooking and he's always looking forward to whatever i'm cooking so for the omelette i used the the extra virgin olive oil i used about table two tablespoons um, and then I that those are the potatoes cooking and you add the omelette to the pan make sure that the heat is not too much I love to use uh, a gas stove because it's at the moment it's quite economical yeah so you add you can add to the omelette some parsley just to add some flavor and also to improve um, how it looks yeah so that should cook for about five minutes then you prepare your sauce i used the worcester sauce plus tomato ketchup and some um mayonnaise so you mix the three you i also added some milk because later on i noticed that it was too thick so you may want to add some milk just to lighten um, the sauce and you're going to use the sauce for your potatoes so um, after you prepare this you then go ahead and set your table because by the time you're done with all these your potatoes should be ready and also your omelette should be so you set the table and you have your watermelon your beetroot salad your sauce your omelette and your potatoes and you can have that with your favorite juice or your tea or anything that you or even water if you want so enjoy your meal so you guys have no excuse to eat a healthy breakfast at least i've given you one recipe so i want you to share with me some of the healthy meals that you're having um, for your breakfast or maybe even for your lunch or for your dinner and yeah let's grow healthy natural hair exercise and take lots of water and avoid being stressed and i think your hair should be fine so thank you for watching ladies i'll see you in the next video bye bye